Earth. Welcome back to the channel. My name is Brian from Kingdom Hearts and Cross Nation. And for today's episode, we're going to be going over the Cyx Plus uh, Falling Price deal banner that we have right now in the shop. Uh, normally, I like to have my metal analysis videos separate from my actual advice on whether or not to actually get the metal or not. So without further ado, let's get started uh, with the video. Let's go ahead and take a look at the banner. So here's the banner right now. Let's take a look at the details real quick. So we know it's falling price. Uh, it's a five pool mercy as well, just like usual. And this month we are getting the poison two plus max, uh, which is great. Last month we got the paralysis uh, two plus max with Zexion plus. So this time we're getting poison two max with Psyx plus. So because of the fact we're getting poison two max plus, uh, I would be assuming that next month for Axel, whenever he comes out on the 13th, okay? Um, I would be assuming that we will also be getting Sleep 2 Max Plus for Axel next month, which is absolutely huge. Uh, if you happen to check out my last video, the how to guarantee skip three medals uh, in PvP, in case you're not aware, you basically have to use the Sleep status ailment skill in order to cause that to happen. And getting the Sleep Max skill for next month is going to be absolutely probably the most critical <laughs> skill in pvp in like months to come okay so keep an eye out for that but at the very least in terms of Cyax plus uh, let me go ahead and look at all the medals that we can get in these pulls uh for this banner so it's five pull mercy bowl it's falling price deal again this is the medal uh by now i hope you guys would know what the medal does and these are the returning medal details or medals that you can get from each of these pulls, at the very least one of these. Uh, Karen Shion EX, the originals, HD Zack, HTP, HD Zexion, HD Larxene, uh, Yuno Riku and Pain, and uh, The World Ends With You Art 2. Out of these medals right here, uh, obviously excluding these guys, because these are obviously like the main breadwinners of this like bunch, uh, the main medals that I think would be worth it would be this group right here uh, HD Zexion because like I mean it's HD Zexion it's pretty good uh, has good debuffers and has a little bit of turtling in it as well I say these two because of the fact that they are very good raid medals and because of the fact they've been reprinting uh, these two as well as the HD Armored Ericus uh, metal as well so much it's become quite very easy to actually get raid traits on those metals uh, which at, which then makes them highly effective raiding metals and personally for me i think for both of those actually now i have two raid traits on each of them i also say hd zach because even though there is tons of metals out there that can easily replace his type of ability now um he's still a pretty decent metal they're not the greatest obviously but they're pretty decent now, a lot of people are constantly asking me, is it worth uh, keeping or replacing the Poison 2 Max skill that's on Cyax and like what to do with it and such. And basically what I have to say about that is the fact, because of the fact that Cyax Plus is quite literally one of the strongest damage metals in the entire game in terms of multiplier, uh, only second to the Illustrated Invisible solely because of the fact Illustrated Invisible has like a 0 0.02 or 6 higher multiplier or something like it's, it's very small very minimal but technically it is higher Cyx plus is literally one of the two strongest damage metals in the entire game in terms of multiplier um so because of this i do not recommend having poison 2 max plus on him at all whatsoever if anything uh the poison 2 max plus is really good okay especially uh in order to try and help get rid of opponents as soon as in pvp the skill is very good the problem is it's just not very good on him so if possible the ideal situation would be to pull one of his trait medals within his banner that comes with the skill on it so that way you can fuse the trait medal along to a different metal that you would want the actual poison 2 plus max skill on instead that would be the ideal situation it's not going to happen for everyone uh, like it didn't happen for me for my instance i'm possibly considering whether or not i should even uh, pull maybe once or one or two more times just to see if I can get a trait medal because I would really like to have that skill just in case but I don't know we will see we will see in terms of whether or not I think you should actually pull for Cyax plus though uh, these are my thoughts about this and a kind of difference between whether or not you're actually a uh, veteran or not within the game 
uh, as kid, chances are, if you're a veteran within the game, chances are you already have some of the best medals in the game anyways, um, which makes having the need of Psyx Plus not nearly as uh, important or as valuable. And although, just to clarify, the fact that Psyx Plus is one of the two strongest damage models in the entire game because of its multiplier gives him automatic value. Um, it's just a matter of how much value to you per se. So, uh, what I'm going to say is starting off, I'm going to talk about the veterans. For veterans, if you already have like the really strong damage medals such as like Scar, uh, Lexius Plus, uh, King Triton, Illustrated Diz, Illustrated Invisible, those really high damaging damage medals for example, if you have like any of these, you honestly can get away with not having the Psyx Plus model to be honest. I only got it because I had like over 20k jewels so I was just like eh why not. I would still have enough jewels anyways afterwards after mercying him to still be able to pull for anything else to have him comes out anyways. So for me I was just like you know what why not it's not gonna hurt me plus I'll have the metal just in case like I, I actually need to use it sometime in the future. So that was me personally. But yeah if you already have any of those metals uh, then you probably don't really need to worry about Psyx Plus nearly as much. Because yes, it does have a higher multiplier, but it's not that significantly higher of a multiplier. It's only higher by like, what, like five or six digits? Now for everybody else who is like a beginner or intermediate player, uh, then the value of Psyx Plus for you guys actually increases more now. Um, simply because of the fact that ch if you don't have any, any of those medals like I mentioned before, such as like Scar, uh, King Triton, or even Warrior of Light, I forgot to mention that as well. Those really hard-hitting damage medals, then uh, Psyx Plus is going to be a very obvious value medal for you, just because he's one of the highest damage medals in the game. Um, on top of the fact that if you happen to not have very good power medals in the game as well, that would also be valuable for you to get him as well, because even if you choose not to use him as a damage medal for whatever reason, um, you can still use him as a buffer metal. I might not recommend it compared to what's already out in the game at the moment, but uh, you can still choose to do so because he does provide max buffs. Uh, so even if you're not using a reverse setup and you just simply lack power in general, you can still get him because he still provides max power and max general strength buffs for you to be able to use. And if you have enough 7 stars, even just tier 4 7 star uh, medals, or even 7 star prime medals, whatever, those provide plus 3 upright buffs to help you get the max upright buffs anyway. So quite honestly, it just comes down to an individual value on your guys part as to how valuable is the metal to you. There's no dire need to actually get this metal, but that's not saying that there isn't actual value in the metal as well. It does have value. It's just a matter of because of how the metal is, how much value does this metal have to you personally as a player? So they're not, I'm going to pretty much leave it up to you guys whether or not you should think you should pull for it. But if you enjoyed the episode, please leave a like and subscribe and hit that bell button. It's the best way to know when I upload more videos such as this one. But other than that, my name is Brian from Kingdom Martini Cross Nation and I will see you guys in the next video. Peace.